Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Angelo from the Beer Baseball blog, The Adventures of Craft Beer and Baseball, and I'm here today to do a product review and pack opening of 2020 Panini Extra Elite Edition. So let's jump right into it. So today we're going to be opening a box, a hobby box of 2020 Panini Elite Extra Edition. Five packs per box, five cards per pack. This has grown to be one of my favorite sets of this season, uh, focusing more on prospects uh, both here in the United States as well as in the Dominican Prospect League. What I love the most about this box and this product, it's a great value for the amount of hits you get. So you get a guaranteed eight autos and two relic cards uh, in this set. So about 10, uh, 10 bucks a hit. Um, so it's a great value uh, to get some great prospect hits. So it wouldn't be the beer baseball blog if I didn't uh, enjoy an ice cold beer uh, with this today's pack opening. So today I'll be enjoying from uh, Longunitas Brewing Company, uh, the daytime IPA, which I had once on the beer baseball blogcast before. Light, crisp, refreshing. Uh, low carb and low calorie uh, beer. So uh, with that, I'm going to uh, drink some beer and get going with this uh, box opening of 2020 Elite Extra Edition. All right, so here it is, 2020 Panini Elite Extra Edition. Uh, as you can see there, eight autos, two memorabilia cards or relic per pack or per box. So we're gonna go ahead and get this open again. Uh, one of the things, uh, some of the things that we're looking for here, we're looking for obviously a Torkelson or Kerjad um, or uh, you know, any of those uh, top draft picks, Drew Romo, uh, anything like that are gonna be considered really good hits. There's also one of one uh, printing plate cards in here, which I pulled in a previous box prior so there you have it panini elite extra edition let's get our go ahead and get our packs out <clears throat> put that box there and uh, we're gonna go ahead and get going here so first pack here let's see what we got all right so it looks like we have a henry ramos uh, base from the dominican prospect league we have here uh, Yo, Yo, Yondri Vargas, a die cut numbered out of 10. Wow, that's awesome. <clears throat> Eight out of 10, Dominican Prospect League. We have our first relic card here. We have Alex Baum from the Philadelphia Phillies. Prospect Materials Patch. Beautiful looking card there. We have our first auto hidden gems. Auto here from Mike Bowman from the Baltimore Orioles. And lastly, we have our um, Carter Baumler from Baltimore out of 120. So some good stuff there. We'll get that out of the way. All right, next pack, let's see what we got. All right, there we go. We got a Spencer Torkelson base out of 999, number one draft pick. We have a prism, a gold prism of Drew Romo from the Colorado Rockies. That is a, another low numbered card, four out of 10. Really good hit there. We have our first auto in this pack, Werner Blakely from LA, Elite Extra Edition auto. Uh-oh, here we go, baby. Let's go, Spencer Torkelson Extra Elite Edition Auto. Not numbered, but still a Torkelson Auto. So really, really big hit. That's awesome. That one's going right in the PC. And lastly, we got Brady Lindsley out of 499 Aspirations uh, Parallel. Wow. We got that Torque Auto. We'll go ahead and put that off here to the side so we can show that bad boy off. So we got a Torkelson base and a Torkelson auto. What a box. All right, pack number three. 
We're gonna go with Luke Little from Chicago Base out of $9.99. We got a die cut out of $98, CG Van Eyck from Toronto. We have a Prime Numbers Auto out of 205, Jack Hartman from Pittsburgh. We have a Patch Auto from Jelson Coca from the Dominican Prospect League. That's 54 out of 199. So a really great card there. And lastly, we have 249 status, Taylor Dollard out of Seattle. All right, pack number four. All right, we're gonna start off with our base, Kyle Nicholas out of 9.99. Followed by our die cut, Holden Powell, Decade from Washington, numbered out of 9.99. Here we go, baby. Another big hit here, Heston Kurjad, Collegiate National Team USA, Triple Patch Relic. That's another big hit too, that's awesome. There we go, there we go. We have a college ticket autograph, Carmen Milanski. Another beautiful looking auto there. And rounding out pack number four, we have Yerlin Luis out of 499 aspirations from the Dominican Prospect League. All right, guys, here we go. What can we get in our final pack? Again, you can see why this has been uh, one of my favorite sets here this season based on the number of hits. Uh, and we got two Torkel sets today. So that is fantastic. That is awesome. I'm excited to continue to do these pack openings and product reviews for you. We have LG Jones the fourth Elite Extra Edition base numbered out of 9.99. We have Ryland Bannon, a Panini Contenders draft pick. We have a die cut auto numbered to 37, Case Williams, prime numbers. A lot of low numbered cards this uh, this box, which is really great. We have an uh, on-card auto, Elite Extra Edition, Keterson Pavon uh, from the Dominican Prospect League. Uh, this one is not numbered, but it's an on-card auto, which is a nice look there. Signed right on that line. And lastly, we have our Garrett Mitchell out of 215 Prime Numbers. So what an awesome uh, box that we got here today. Um, I can't believe that we pulled a uh, Spencer Torkelson Auto and a uh, Heston Kerjad um, Triple Patch Relic. So there you have it, 2020 Panit Extra Elite Edition. These go for about 100 to 120 bucks right now. Again, great value for the number of hits you get, 10 hits per box. Um, and uh, really happy uh, and excited to open this box here for you today and get these big hits for you. So um, with that, we will not see you at the baseball field, but we will see you each and every Tuesday night at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time for the Beer Baseball Blog Cast, along with myself, uh, Michael Mondragon, and Kevin Lyon. Additionally, don't forget to check us out on eBay, our Etsy store, and please um, become one of our Patreon uh, Patreon members or patrons on Patreon, uh, as we ha now have a uh, Patreon uh, member page. So. Thanks, guys. Take care, and we'll, we will see you next time.